Welcome back to this channel. In this video, I will teach you the process of how to make the paint last longer on fabric or shirt. Aside from the shirt, we also need a board or plywood that is slightly wider than the shirt that you are going to use. Its purpose is to stretch the shirt. If you can't have a board this size, you can use any smaller board, but you will need the paper clips to stretch the shirt. The next step is to apply thick layers of white paint. Usually, 3 to 4 layers are enough, but if you want to apply more, it's better. On every layer to hasten the process, you can use a hot air gun or a hair blower. After spraying on paint, you will notice some little fibers sticking out. To eliminate this, we will use a heat press machine. Now, don't worry if you don't have this machine. You can use an iron. Another thing we need is a Teflon sheet. The purpose of this is for the paint not to stick onto the hot metal surface of the machine or the iron. Without this, it's impossible to heat press or iron your clothes. If you have the machine, set it at 30 seconds at around 175 to 185 degrees. If you are using an iron, set it to the hottest temperature and put a little more weight while ironing your shirt till you see the surface is flat or smooth. After this, you can already airbrush your shirt like you normally do. My only tip is to make everything thick. I prefer to do multiple passes to make the lines thicker and more vivid. After you paint your design, heat press again or iron your shirt. The same temperature. 30 seconds at 175 to 185 degrees. Just a reminder, sometimes the process of putting some layers of paint might not be applicable. But if you want your artwork to last longer, you can consider this method. Thank you for watching. Salute.